Hello. Need another vacation? I can sense you're a bit stressed. Have no fear. That's why I'm here. Your virtual travel guide. Today, your guided meditation will take you on a journey where you get to enjoy one spot around the world. The question is, will you be able to guess your destination? Before we begin, let's take a chill pill. Let's unwind, relax, and recline, and then I promise you, you'll feel just fine. Hey, I'm a poet, and I didn't even know it. Take a slow, deep inhale, and a complete Exhale. Let your mind feel at ease. Excellent. Just like that. Find your happy place is what some people would say. But today, I'm already taking you to a happy place. So, honestly, you don't need to do much but sit back and enjoy the smooth ride. Let's begin. See if you could figure out where our journey is taking you today. Don't worry, my tranquil travelers. I will give you clues along the way. We've arrived. We're somewhere in the Caribbean Sea. I know, could I be more vague? Instantly, you feel the warmth of the sun in the sand under your feet. You're on a beach, walking distance from downtown. The sea is calming, and the water is so clear, you can pretty much see right through it. See what I did there? Oh, come on, it's okay to laugh a little. This popular hotspot 
has umbrellas lined up along the beach, keeping you cool and delaying your inevitable sunburn. Perfect. It's time for your first excursion. Horseback riding. You ride through the backcountry trails. Sweet sounds of horses galloping. It's peaceful. But wait, there's more. You're not just riding on land. As you approach the waterfront, you and the horse ride straight into the sea. You feel true horsepower as your companion swims into the waves, taking you along. <laughs> Good thing you brought your bathing suit. It's quite an epic experience. About an hour out from the city, you take a tour where you see a labyrinth of limestone caves. The grotto is filled with stalagmites and stalactites. and the walls are lined with glistening green algae. If you look close enough, you can spot little bats hanging upside down on the ceiling. These caves stretch over 64 acres. Plus, in one part of the cave, there's a crystal clear lake that was featured in the James Bond movie Live and Let Die from 1973. What's great about the city you're staying in is that it's central to most of the day trip adventures. So, you drive west for about an hour and a half, and you reach an activity that's really meant for the brave of heart. Cliff diving. Cliffs can reach up to 40 feet high. If you're a thrill seeker, this might be the activity for you. It's a great way to take the edge off, literally, but it's also nice to just sit and watch others do the diving. It's also a lovely spot to watch dolphins in the sunset. And it's right next to a cafe 
a good place to grab some grub before you head back to your accommodations. Next up, you've got another rockin' day planned. You go off-roading on a wild jeep safari tour. And when I say off-roading, I mean off the road. Get prepared to receive an unintentional mud bath because it can be a bumpy ride. But in the best way possible. You get to share this Jeep ride with seven other friendly folks. You're surrounded by a lush, tropical atmosphere and even get to see some hidden waterfalls. Your trip is coming close to an end. But wait, you can't leave before you get your souvenirs. You pop into the open air market. It's lively, filled with music and treats. What's that over there? Ooh, that would make a great gift. And that. Oh, and that. After buying almost everything in the market, you make your way home. Now, our journey has come to an end. So, did you guess where we were? You stayed in Montego Bay, a city in Jamaica. Montego Bay is located on the north coast and is one of Jamaica's most popular destinations. Take a slow, deep inhale. Now, a complete exhale. Thank you for letting me be your travel guide today. Until next time, flutters away. <laughs>